Welcome to model 40030 Deluxe Hoist Rope Threading Instructions. Once you've got your components laid out, the first thing you're going to want to do is thread one end of the rope through the hole on the mounting bracket that doesn't have the locking mechanism on it and form a double knot. Make sure on your second knot that it goes over the first knot you created to create a nice big knot so that the rope won't pull through the hole. Once complete, we're going to need to use the other end of the rope. Take the other end of the rope, thread it through one of the sets of hooks. Next, run it through the pulley on the mounting bracket that doesn't have the locking mechanism. Now, we're going to take that end of the rope and thread it through one of the pulleys on the locking mechanism underneath the locking mechanism itself and then through one of the holes. Here's a close-up shot. We're going to take the rope, go through the pulley, underneath the locking mechanism, and finally through the hole. To make sure that the rope is lined up respectively. We're going to pull our rope all the way through just to give you a better idea of how the rope threading will look. Next, we're going to take the end of the rope and thread it back through the locking mechanism. In this case, first we'll go through the other hole not used, back underneath the locking mechanism, and at this point it might be a good idea to pull some extra rope through. Then we're going to run the end of the rope over the other pulley. Now let's go to a close-up view of this step. Again, we're going to take the end of the rope, run it through the other hole, underneath the locking mechanism, and over the other pulley wheel. Finally, we're going to take the end of the rope, run it through the pulley wheel on the other set of hoist arms, through the hole on the mounting bracket with the locking mechanism on it, and we're going to form another double knot. Again, make sure to form a large double knot so that the rope cannot pull through the hole. At this point, your threading is complete and you're ready to mount the hoist. We do want to point out that with this threading, you'll notice that the end of the rope is actually just a loop. There will not be two pieces of rope, it's just one piece. The threading is complete, now you can mount your hoist and enjoy it. Thank you.